Today I'll be doing a care video on Ryder Sliders and as you can see I'm actually holding one right here. His name is Blair and he's almost a year old. So I'll start off by talking about the required lighting and basking area. So first off, all turtles need a UVB light to produce vitamin D3 which they need in order to absorb and metabolize calcium as well as other vitamins and minerals. The second type of UV light is UVA which is very important to the feeding, breeding, and behavior of your pet turtle. You will also need to have a heat source such as a heat bulb because turtles are cold-blooded and cannot produce their own body heat. Without this lighting, your turtle will most likely get very sick and may die. For the basking area, you must provide a place for your turtle to completely get out of the water and dry off. Turtles bask to get the necessary exposure to the UV lights and to warm up. If they don't have a spot to bask, they can get fungal infections and may die. The temperature of the basking area should stay in the range of 85 to 92 degrees Fahrenheit. Red Earth sliders are strong swimmers and do very well in deep water. The water temperature should stay to 75 to 86 degrees Fahrenheit. If the temperature is too low, they will become inactive and probably stop eating. You can maintain the temperature of the water by using a submersible water heater. Water quality is also very important to the health of your turtle. If the water is dirty, bacteria and organisms will start to grow and your turtle can get very sick. You will need a filter that is meant for about two to three times the amount of water in your tank in order to keep the tank clean because turtles are very messy. You should do a complete water change every month, which means draining, cleaning, and refilling your aquarium. Red-eared sliders get very big with males reaching about six to nine inches and females 10 to 12 inches. The general rule of thumb is every inch of shell equals to 10 gallons of water. So if you have a turtle that is six inches long, for example, they will need a 60 gallon tank. Male sliders will have very long front claws and a long tail, while females will have very short front claws and a short tail. Sliders can also live for 50 to 70 years. Juvenile sliders are carnivorous but will still eat plant matter while adults are mainly omnivorous. Juveniles should be fed every day and adults every other day. You should feed turtle pellets such as Missouri, Zoomed, and Reptomin, but there are also lots of other brands. I actually use all the brands I listed, but I prefer Missouri because it's a well-balanced diet and has all the nutritional needs so you don't need to use supplements. They also need plant matter once or twice a week, such as romaine lettuce, carrot, and mustard greens. Animal matter, such as earthworms, occasional feeder fish, and mealworms should be fed. You also should dust their food with calcium containing D3 and offer cuddle bone as another calcium source. And do not just feed pellets, turtles need a variety of food. Thanks for watching guys, and if you have any questions, just comment down below and please subscribe, thanks!